she's a little too into animals. He's a little too into the horses. He's like, I'm really into animals. She she has a hundred horses. What could you expect? I mean, listen. A hundred horses and a dog fetish. (laughs) I mean, look at Jared. He has a dog fetish. He's doing great in life. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Dropouts, episode 51. Um, Indy. Wait. I can still fill in for Indy. I don't know how to, how do he do an Australian accent? I don't know, but the podcast is already better. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Just kidding. We, <laughs> we'd love to have you back at some point, right? Yeah, whenever you want to come back. This is our official host now. Yep. Um, Actually, I am like the host, like Indy's fired. That's fine. That's true. Is this her, this is where she's going to find out about it? Mm-hmm. That's good to know. Yeah, Indy, you're fired. Okay, so you, you guys are, are going to see if she's watching it or not. Because if she <laughs> comes oh back gosh, and thinks wait, she. so can we talk about the beach trip? I mean, <laughs> come on, Zach. Well, no, Should I we just talk about the beach trip. I you would already know she's gonna be like, Zach, take down right now. <laughs> yeah, no, <laughs> I mean, I would, I wouldn't mind talking about it, but I feel like she would book a one way flight here and then yell at you and leave. Yeah, or yeah. well, then round trip she would do. Yeah. Yeah, 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 round trip. She might take off a limb, but we're here with Christian again. What's up, kid? How you doing, bro? I am decent, as the kids say. Jared, can I get some sweet, sweet intro music? Okay. Wow, this is nice. Is it sweet, sweet? Like you oh, it's so it. sweet. Uh, um, before we get too much into it, we're trying to get 100,000 subscribers before our one-year podcast, which, which is, is next, next week. week. So um, tell your cousin about it and have him subscribe, all right? It's also my birthday next Jared, week. So Jared. <gasps> that oh should my be gosh, how old are you turning? 23. Dang. You literally yeah. had one last year, and you act like every year you need one, which is a little yeah, pretentious. Dude, as I grow up, I'm starting to notice that everybody has like a birthday like once a year. It feels <laughs> like. and, it, yeah. and then they make it all about them. Yep. It's yeah. like, oh, yeah. So, like, crazy, dude. That just that just reminded me so much. Is like, it's like, life is crazy. I just found out the same day you were born is your birthday or whatever oh that, vi- yes. that vine was. That's so funny. Um, we were talking about the Friends reunion right before this. I was like, hey, Mads, I watched the friend re- Friends reunion. I know you like it. She's like, oh, I went to the premiere. And then I realized... Uh, where we uh, were on levels, and I was like, "Oh my bad, I watched <laughs> it on my couch." Uh, no. Uh, no, on your mom's couch. On my mom's couch. Okay. <laughs> your, mom's couch. And your mom cried when she watched it. She, she, you said. Yeah, she did cry, but yeah. she does that almost every day anyway. So I oh. didn't know if it was that was about the show or what it was. Yeah. Um, over to you. You're the host. I need you to. I need you to. The host. Okay, I actually have a question. I'm staring at the tennis balls over there. Do you pl- you play tennis, right? I do t- play so tennis. Do you play tennis with Indy? I do. Does she, is she good? Does she suck? She's decent. <laughs> Um, when she goes out there, she doesn't like being bad at anything. So once she gets that bad at so something, true. she starts pouting. She's like, I don't want to do this anymore. I'm like, well, we're going to stay out here. and have <laughs> Yes, a, a, I think I'm the same way. Though. And be okay with it. And then after five minutes, she's like, love it again. I was like, look at those mood swings. Um, yes. So that's beautiful. That's so fun. I'll, have you been playing tennis forever? I have. Yeah. I have. Wow. You, am I getting interviewed? Yeah, you are. I've never been interviewed You've before. Never been interviewed. What about our guest? You got to introduce her. Yeah. Guys, this is this is Severin, actually, everyone. His new Instagram name is Severin. Yeah. You want to explain that? Yeah, I'll give you a little explanation. Um, <laughs> as of today, a lot of my followers have noticed my ads on everything changed from my full name, Christian Plory, to Severin, um, oh. which is actually my artist name. Oh. So, yeah. Yeah. Nice. He's a painter, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a painter, yeah. <laughs> Your hit music's coming out very soon, the 7th, I assume, of July. A lot of people would think so. But, but just the 777, seven, seven, I don't know. I don't know. You're close. I'm cl- I could be close. close. You're in the ballpark. Throw everybody off with an eight. Yeah. Which everybody like, okay. Or weird, a six. Weird marketing. Hit them. Let's do it. Before they expect it. Ooh. That's nice. You that's never know. Nice. I'm not going to say yeah, too also, much. Um, <laughs> well, when is this coming out? Um, um, next Sunday or this Sunday. Um, yeah, this, this Sunday. This Sunday. So do you want to explain to them what that means? Like the why 13th. you changed it? Because it'll, it'll oh, yeah. be out on if Instagram. It's like, yeah, so tomorrow, actually, I'm going to post, you know, what Severn means to me. Because a lot of people are probably like, where do you get, like, Severn from? You know what I mean? Yeah. Um. So, you know, when I was born, throwback, 20 years ago. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, when I was born, um, my parents were picking out names. And my brothers came pretty easily. He's named after my dad. Um, Is he the firstborn? Yep. Okay. He's four minutes older than me. Gotcha. So love him. I, yeah. He probably holds that over your head, dude. I don't Does care. When I'm eighty, year. I'm gonna be like, bro, I'm younger than you. Hold that. <laughs> you know what I mean, um, yeah, true. His beauty and youth. My sister. Exactly. So, um, but yeah. So I was. My parents were picking out a name for me. It didn't come so easily because Will was named after my dad, and um, you know, Christian came from you know like the biblical reference and stuff like that. But for me, they were choosing between that and Severn, and Severn was my dad's grandfather's name. Oh, that's a dope ass yeah. name. <laughs> so I spelt it a little different. I spelt it in the way that I felt fit my musical presence the best. You know what I mean? Um, but it was just something that meant something to me because I was like, dude, it was like my almost name. 
found yeah. out, you know, my it was my dad's, it was my great grandfather's name. Um, it just stuck out. It was unique. It was something that kind of just felt like family, but at the same time held its own individuality. No, that's sick. We're yeah. excited to hear some new music. I'm probably going to listen to it while I'm in the shower, you know, jam out a little bit. Sure. You can join me if you want. Yeah. Um, so you're a triplet. <laughs> you're, um, you're a twin. I can't imagine if you get, so if you guys have children, does like just multiply, just six come out or what? How does <laughs> <laughs> is no, that actually, how biology works? A lot works? of people think that like, yeah, you know, triplets run in my family, but we're the only triplets in my entire family. Like everything, and my mom actually couldn't get pregnant, so they did it in vitro. So nice. it was like you know, grab a little, grab a little, put yeah, together. Boom. This. <laughs> Everyone go. can hear me. There you <laughs> go. You kind of like you won't like this for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, but yeah. So we were in vitro, so we were like you know, put three and hope one takes, and all three took. And now it came. Right I I just want to know your mom's. What was your mom's face when she was like, oh, how many? <laughs> do you do, um, do they talk I'm about it? I'm not sure. I think my dad is probably shocked. Oh yeah, he's like, okay, I can do a kid. Three? Oh, oh, three? three. Should I divorce her? No, I'll stay. I'll stay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go grab some milk real quick. Yeah, I'm going to grab. Just never be back. A lot of milk. <laughs> a lot of. <laughs> so in stop. Idaho. I just, uh, I just read a story about a woman that had um, deck tuplets. She had 10 kids. That's Okay, that's a litter. So <laughs> let's say what ten. it is. I think she had seven boys and three girls. Oh, gosh. And like, dude, the so pictures many. of her when she's pregnant, I'm talking, like, it looks like. There's just a boulder inside of her. <laughs> like hot. it's just like boom. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. My uh. my mom did not want a boy. She was very adamant about having a girl and like doing all the girl so. stuff you do with girls. Exactly. Not happy with what she, with with the result. So she was um, a little drugged out because um, I was born, and she had five of her friends come in and be like, "Hey, it, what what is it?" And the first friend's like, "It's a boy," and she's like. No, and she started crying, and she asked the next one, "What is it? A boy?" She had to get through all of them until she finally realized it was a boy and accepted it. I don't know if she still accepted it, but um, um, I don't think so. Okay, well then, if you were gonna be a girl, do you know what she would have named you? Marissa, which is <laughs> I, which is awkward because that's my ex's name. Um, but that's Everything what she always tells for me. Reason. Yeah, right. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, y'all. My, my dad just wasn't even trying. That boy planted a seed, and two came out of it. So you know, <laughs> that yes. was it. She said, let's get in and get out. Oh, well, yeah. for and, life? And my mom was supposed to have a daughter at first. She had a miscarriage. Oh, so it wasn't even sad. like trying. But I I mean, it was very sad. So you guys were an accident, right? Yeah. Ooh, accident, <laughs> baby. I was accident, Jared. There's no way you could have been an accident. Yeah, they she has literally a receipt chose for you. you. She, <laughs> no, I told you. Okay, so we figured it out. Zach told this joke one time. He's like, the only reason you're alive is because your mom's credit card didn't get declined. Right. Okay. If she <laughs> can buy you with Venmo now, like you're not a real human, is what I'm saying. <laughs> Wait, how what? would a credit card get declined? Because think like, about it. Like, what? It's credit. It just takes out no matter. You can go negative. You know what? Like why? Your life matters. My, it was gonna you. happen anyways. Thank you. Yeah. But to we, Wells Fargo. So we I found didn't out. That. I, I told my mom that joke like when when I went back home recently, and she was like, she's like, oh, funny story. Actually, um, the the last time that I went, because she went five times to have me, like, and none of them took. And then the last time, they actually didn't charge her credit card. So I I was a freebie, technically. We stole a balloon. <laughs> 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 we stole. Just wait. You're out there on theft, bro. I know. Yeah. I didn't choose the thug. You are the stolen thug life property. Chose me. <laughs> You're literally stolen property. <laughs> no Shit. Way. Is your mom a little sad because like she tried six times and like you're the one that took her? Yeah, I know. She always thinks she's like, man, number three. Could number three could answer. Yeah, and then you're out here. Uh, Dude, he literally is. Items podcast. left overnight yeah, become property of establishment. <laughs> <laughs> yep. My boy was in that lost and found. <laughs> I feel absolutely violated yeah, right dude, now. I'm kind of teeing up over here. I got to chill out. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is that beef that we had the last time when I pushed your girl. <laughs> oh, that's true. Yeah, you should pull on tackle. Really? No, low key though. I, the Ravens gave me a call and asked about you. I don't know if you're looking to play like <laughs> linebacker. I know 52 is retired, but you know. Oh, you got to yeah. put that weight back on. Yeah. Oh, I'll start right now. I'll eat the rest of Gina's brownies in there. Those are my mom. Just start with the tennis brownies. balls. Brownies? <laughs> you said they're brownies? Yeah, uh, brownies? Jared's got a few you can try. No, Zach has a few. Wait, can, can we can do try. my mom? Wait, I already ate all mine. Can we do you my- ate all of yours? I really like the brownies. Can we do a mom's brownie review? Do you guys like brownies? Mm -hmm. Love them. Would you guys want one right now? Yeah. I'll eat a brownie. I'll eat a brownie. My, my mom's brownies, I think, are one of the best desserts in the world. I would like an honest review. Like, okay. rip them apart if they're terrible. Okay? okay. <laughs> Tastes like dirt. <laughs> don't hold <laughs> back. I can never, bro. I don't have the heart to be, like, rude like that. Okay. Do you want the smaller one because you're full? You just want the bigger <laughs> one. Bitch. Do you want? Can I have both since you're full? Okay, I need honest reviews. If you hate them, you oh hate them. 
It tastes like cake. <laughs> it tastes more like cake than a brownie. I know. That's a big controversy in my household. We no, but I like that. I know. We bring it up, and she goes, it's brownies. It says in the recipe. So, well, uh, Can I give a number? Oh, yeah, yeah, you can give a number. And if you don't like it, feel free. No, no, no. 9.1. 9.1. 9.1. That's pretty good. I love the consistency of cake. Because I think brownies can be too tough sometimes if you I like, like overcook it. I like the consistency of brownies. Oh, oh so this is pretty bad. I like the flavor. Okay. okay. A lot. I would give it same nine. Wow. Well, that's a rookie score. Good. Right? <laughs> like, I know my food with that point one, yeah. right? Yep. yep. <laughs> I'll keep eating it. It's probably good. You want to, like, be precise or just a like, solid like, nine? Like, like, soft nine, hard nine? Like, you, where's the nine at? Well, as if it's a soft nine or hard nine, she's getting pleased, is all I'm saying. <laughs> um,. Ugh. So you on, you honestly like it? I can I guess I do. Okay, okay. I do. I like it. Okay. Yeah. No, so I what? feel like isn't like soft nine like closer to eight and a half, hard nine closer to nine and a half. Exactly. That's yeah. what I figured. But you yeah. know, what, Zach, that was that was bars. I'm not gonna lie. Thank you so much. I, I'm trying to be a rapper. He's very witty. Oh, you I've, have no idea. I've noticed like no, bro. You kind of remind me like I do that thing too, where like I'll just make analogies really quick or like spin off or something. Yeah, sometimes it yeah, gets me you, in a lot of trouble. Freestyle for us, everyone. We'll just do it right now. <laughs> Jared's the best freestyler I know. No. Watch, give him a word. Any not. word, he'll freestyle. Hell. No, I hate mm. this. You got Come this. on, bro. You got this. No, I don't. I don't even know. I don't know a word. Just, just give him any Brownie. word. Brownie. Brownie. There we go. Uh, Come on, don't be nervous. Um, you got to combine words, too. Like, if it was in, like, a go, text Mr. of a word. Come on. You can do it. I don't know. There's, like, so many things you can do with rap. Like, Brownie, you can think of a word that would... Stop talking, rhyme with it. brownie, but if I was <laughs> in the middle of a rap, I would say Free brownie, time. and then I would talk about my city and say where the town be. That's just how I would rap. Oh, I try to Wait, do like hold a on. He's a, we need to get him on sway real quick, <laughs> <laughs> bro. That's actually one of my goals because I want to do like you know punk music and like yeah. rock. But like everybody that I know growing up, like knows that I freestyle. So like I want like a you know like a rockish punk artist to go on like a sway in the morning. Be like, wait, this kid can freestyle. You know what I mean? Like yeah. like, a, like a rapper would just like shock. The world, you know. That was like, I saw Shia LaBeouf on uh, mm-hmm. what what was it? Sway in the morning. Sway. Yeah. Bro, he crushed it. Yeah, I Did was like, really? wow, that's really really good. Anyway, Jared Brownie, I'm baked like a brownie. Uh huh. Okay. Post, post it up in my town where I. What do you say? Where the town be? <laughs> where the town be? Okay, keep uh, going. Nope, that's all I got. They got you. <laughs> that's all I got. Stole it from. <laughs> and I stole out of my bars yeah. from yeah. him. Yeah. Dude, you do so many things. Then you talk about how people roast you. Say they can't clown me. Like you just go on and what go on. What the hell? Go on. Why can't you just do it? I can't just don't show the world right now. Don't, don't I'm not nervous. nervous. Freestyling, I've freestyled in front of so many people at once. So it's like, that's mm-hmm. the last thing. Yeah. Did they used to have like, when you were in school, uh, like freestyle battles? That's like, where I started. Or, that's where you at started? At the lunch table, oh, that's dude. that's where you started, at the lunch table. Dude, I used to get like detentions for pen tapping in middle school because my, teacher, <laughs> my teachers liked me, so they would try not to give it to me, but I'd just be like ADHD, just like drumming on yeah. my desk. And then eventually I started doing it while freestyling. And we'd go to the lunch table. You can't get a tension for like rapping at the lunch table yeah i just figured i could rhyme a couple words together it was fun yeah so i, just I can't rap shit well let's hear it brownie no I, brownie uh no i can't i okay. literally can't i'm the type of person that's like oh i can rap and then like rap about like oh my gosh oh fucker and then on the floor i like on like <laughs> you know like the guys that do that no, like, it's like I can rap, and then they're like fucker and pussy like, on the, like okay. all my homies that that's claim aggressive. they know how to rap yeah, will get like a aggressive. couple like sips of alcohol in them and the first thing they say oh fuck bitches and i'm like bro <laughs> what's going on jared bro? do you know what that is what oh didn't have it. Uh, <laughs> no no jared actually that was so good speaking of women um jared told i love you to the first woman he's ever like that first girl that's true in his entire life <laughs> yeah how did it Dude, feel? that's a big accomplishment Our studio wait audience. can wait is there a story by was it like nonchalant or did you like make a big deal out of it when you no it? it was nonchalant like oh yeah like after you use like the snickers well, drop she, or something <laughs> shut up no absolutely this time it was a peanut m <laughs> okay so a few weeks ago she had said it to you <laughs> yeah and, and you didn't say it back and was, was it awkward in the room at that point no no because like i had explained it to her that i was like listen i feel this way but like i've never said it so i'm scared blah 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 and so like we came to an understanding and then by the end of that trip i was like ready to say it and then before i knew it i was already on a plane back to la so then i like i missed my opportunity so then oh wait, what the, the hell yo <laughs> she's about to play qb Oh my okay. God. Right. Dude, that was, a dime. Dime. That's a that was a dime. Yeah, but bro. it was at the computer that's worth a lot of money, and I yeah. do apologize. Thank you. So not only you, but Apple. Pass. Look where you fit it between. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, man. I, I had a lot to go over. Yeah, that's you know. true. Yeah. yeah, yeah. 
Anyways, talk about your story. And then uh, we're just like throwing things at assassinated (laughs) over here. Um, No, and then like, but I was like already headed back to LA and I missed my chance. I was like, oh, that sucks. Like, I really want to say it. And then like pretty much within the first five minutes of seeing her when I went back the first time I said it or the second time. Yes, I said right it. at the beginning. Yeah, and nice. I was just like, I ha- I've i been dying to say this. How many times have you said it since then now? A lot. <laughs> what, <laughs> what was, okay, so you've never said it to a girl before in your life. What flipped the script for you? So now you want to say to this one, why is this the one? Yeah. There's a lot of reasons. You know, Give it's me just six. Like <laughs> Careful, she might be watching this. So oh, she's she definitely, she definitely watching definitely this. She knows about the Snickers story <laughs> well. She's like, can I get a Milky Way? He's like, no. <laughs> um, <laughs> That's not my brand, sweetheart. <laughs> um, no, she's the just like. finger. <laughs> 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 but that, one's, that one might be a little gross. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's just like literally everything that like I could ever want. You know, and so she's kind and supportive and sweet and driven and you know all this stuff. So nice. I'm getting nervous talking about it. Anyway, next subject. Oh, she's Any, gonna love this, dude. Part. Say it I'm getting nervous. and mean it, bro. She's I gonna watch this. It. I do mean it. You and know how many other girls watch this too that are gonna. See I'm sweating, bro. I promise you, there's gonna be like thousands of other girls that watch this, and they're gonna see the way your face lights up when you talk about a girl, and your girlfriend's gonna admire that. So do it. <laughs> this man's gonna bring me to. T- okay, now now talk about your ex and why it went wrong. Uh, let's talk about why Larry keeps bringing up Zach's oh, grandpa. This is, this is so... Uh, do we want to talk about this? Yeah, it'll be fine. Yeah, it's fine. So anytime I see my grandpa, he always asks about how uh, Jared's relationship's going with the his, with Hannah. His mm-hmm. most he's recent very, flame. very invest, invested. Amazing. Hannah. And then my grandpa's like, who else have you dated? And he's like... And my uh, Jared's like, this was like a girl I that kind of tore my heart apart. But my grandpa goes... She's a looker. Look at this hottie. You ever going to get back with her? I'm like, Grandpa, it couldn't be a worse time to say something. And then my mom's been dating someone for eight years, and this was right before Valentine's Day, and they broke up. And my grandpa sits down at the table. He looks at me. He goes, watch this. And he goes, hey, Gina, guess who's not getting anything for Valentine's Day? You. And I was like, I would have cried. And I was like, hey, Grandpa, something we don't ever bring up would be that. He's like, I'm old. Whatever. I'm going to eat the food she made me, too. I was like, wow, that's... Oh my gosh, bro! I love old people so much. Oh, just yeah. half of them are savages, and the other half are so adorable. You just can't just, like stop yeah. looking at them. He's actually a sweet man, but like I don't. But <laughs> no social not skills. Anything no, Valentine's no, no, no social. <laughs> but he said it like matter of fact. He's just like you. You won't be getting anything for Valentine's Day. But the thing is, he has social <laughs> skills because he recognizes that you're not supposed to say these things. But like Christian said, he's just a savage. He yeah. just doesn't care. He's like, I'm yeah. 83, and that just came out of my mouth. What are you gonna do? Dude, Put me in the he, ground. <laughs> already halfway there. <laughs> Bro, he's literally like, no he has nothing to lose. No. Yeah. Like, he can go out happy after saying that. You know? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. He's like, oh, yeah, I was talking to this. He's like, I went back to Nebraska. I was talking to this honey. I was like, what'd you just say? And then he's like, yeah, she's in her 80s. She said, like, the word naughty. And I said, I like naughty girls. And she's like, stop. She's. He's like, if I was in Nebraska, we'd be an item. I said, you just called an 80-year-old girl. You like, like naughty girls. Is he, like, Snapchatting her? Like, what's he no, doing? Like? How is he? Oh, wait, pull up the video of, uh, I'll send it to you. This what if is he's how like, you're a baddie? <laughs> 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 that was so That's funny. So uh, funny. <laughs> this is how I, we picked him up at the airport the other day. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But then, is he in like, town? No, uh, no. Uh, we went Vegas. to Vegas. Oh, amazing. Uh, um, but then funny. there's that one, uh, he was like flirting with that one woman, and he, uh, she was like, she she's like oh Larry stop playing around or whatever he's like call me see if I'm playing oh, or no, something no. like oh. that she's like um so this is another woman an older woman came from my mom's house we're all eating dinner together mm-hmm. and then she's like I get so lonely I'm at my house sometimes and my grandma's like call me if you're ever lonely I'll show up she goes oh you're such a jokester he said call me see if I'm joking <laughs> <And> I <laughs> said okay no way um, dude this guy's a pimp like what a beast like in I the most respectful real. way ever. yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? no at times. All, sometimes uh, we have to rein him in like hey yeah. tap off. <laughs> let's let's tone down on the Viagra. All right, this is him when we went to pick him up from the airport. <laughs> Stand stop. Wait for it. Oh, <laughs> like what? Stand stop, oh baby. Ready Why is he go. in such an aggressive stance? Dude, he's a Shoot. beast, bro. Yeah, he's like okay. women. Here it is. Now, first of all, I just want to put it out there that that full zip gray hoodie. That's that's in. That's oh, like yeah. twenty twenty one style. Oh, oh yeah. he's got that's the drip. Nice. Yeah. And he wears long sleeve shirts. And if it's too hot outside, in the moment, he'll cut <laughs> off the long sleeve shirts and go on with his day. <laughs> and that, it's it's like, why not buy no it? No way. Bro, the high this socks, too. This, yeah, this guy's a beast. He's a stud. For real. 
Oh my god. Yeah, I wish we had a picture of uh of his sleeves because it's ridiculous. Like he'll literally turn like a full length sleeve into like a three quarter, <laughs> but you can like see the thread that he cut and everything. Oh like it's so let's move. Where's he getting these scissors from? Just like <laughs> spawn. Uh, probably Jared's parents. Um holy shit, dude. What? <laughs> Matt's no, I, I get it. Oh, okay, there <laughs> I we go. It. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> you know what? They, that, they know that I was love so them. witty, though. They know Come I on, love right? them more than yeah. anything. I don't want to split up his parents unless one of them likes me more. That's all I'm saying. But, like, I just want to start putting, like, a timer, you know, or, like, going in post and just being, like, from the how many seconds or milliseconds did it <laughs> take from you saying, where did he get these scissors to Zach coming out with that in his mouth you know or uh, honestly dude i don't even think he was about to say something about the coming out of his mouth i saw <laughs> I, I saw him start leaning into his mic <laughs> that I one was too easy yeah yeah no, like I, I don't even <laughs> dude i don't even think i finished the sentence before he started talking about it yeah that was that was uh, it was i apologize okay I, this is what gets me in like trouble you're in lucky school. they like you oh because sometimes i have to like i say things so fast and i'd be like i didn't mean that at all it just came to me and Dude, and you got it from your grandfather. I got it from my grandpa. And mm-hmm. look at him doing well. Yep. Still obviously physical in his old age. Yeah. Like he looks like he's fit, dude. Dude, he's doing his thing. Yeah. Um, say interesting things in the camera. <laughs> I'm so I I because I have nothing to talk interesting about. Interesting things. Yeah, yeah. There's really nothing interesting about me. Okay, what about your um? Oh, I have some. There interesting. we go. I made him watch Harry Potter. Oh, oh first yeah. time. Yep. Dude, and I, he yeah. liked it. I don't care. He's all eight. Okay, loved growing it. up. Growing up. Harry Potter was like one of the, my neighbors loved Harry Potter, so like I didn't really get the hype because I obviously hadn't seen it. So I had this like bias. I'm like, dude, there's no way it could be like that good. <laughs> but I will say, and you were wrong. Everyone, I was wrong. I'll admit that. I will say that everyone that has watched Harry Potter that I've asked, I've never gotten a bad review. Everyone likes it because you know, how, like you watch a movie, some people are like, oh, I didn't like it, I liked it. Everyone that's seen Harry Potter likes it. It's yeah. so good. And like their <laughs> cinematic masterpiece, dude. Man. As I got yes. more into it, like one, I was like, I got it out of the way. Two good movie has potential three now i understand the characters the mm-hmm. plot and i'm like oh Number dude they're growing four. up it's pretty sick four four hooked Goblet me four four was Goblet so good dude yeah yeah four was What's really this? good because i feel like well when i was growing up i would watch it kind of as the actors grew up and as my maturity went up the movie's maturity went up so it went a lot darker as i was getting older i was like this is so cool oh that's why. like the first one's like a kid's movie yeah yeah but the thing is is like the first one that's the worst one but you in order to understand the whole series, you have to watch the first one. Yeah. In my opinion. Yeah. But anyways, I made him watch it. And then we went to Michael's yesterday, and I'm making a cabinet full of potions. Because <laughs> oh. uh, we're moving. It was cute, bro. She was like, we're going to make all these potions. And, like, she was stressing <laughs> herself out trying to find this one powder, dude. I think we went to, like, yeah, we, we called three up, stores. Yeah, we ended up ordering it on uh, Amazon. I need an ear wig. Like, I don't, that's actually a thing only in the book. Um, <laughs> but no, that yeah, we, we found one. What? An ear wig. Ew. You know what an earwig is? He just oh. said it. I just, I just faked it. I didn't know. I just heard it in the book. So what is it? An earwig is a bug that has a pincher on the back. So they call them pincher bugs. Oh, oh of course. And they pincher like are bugs. known for crawling your ears. Really? Oh. Yeah. Well, I've never heard them called pincher bug where I'm from. Everyone says earwig. Oh. That reminds me. That's just a nightmare. Jared, are you into bugs? No. You a bug guy? No? No, I hate Any of bugs you bugs? with a passion. Dude, no. Nah, okay. I took zoology in high school, which is basically catching zoology. insects. But it was a, yeah, it was a sick class because, like, seniors <laughs> were chilling. Teacher, mad cool. We went outside, caught insects. It was pretty dope. <laughs> yeah. Fun. I, the only insect I think I hate are bees. Ooh, why is that? Anything w- with a stinger, honestly. Oh. Like, I don't Scorp- like wasps. That sounds deep. I don't like, like. What about, like, scorpions? They have stingers. Uh, I actually lived in Arizona when I was in um, Phoenix, Arizona, when I was in kindergarten, first grade. And they're just, they're all over your house. Like it doesn't matter. Yeah, they terrifying. just uh, they just randomly appear. Like in the they've gotten like this close to my foot. And like I don't know. Oh. So not that scary. So you got him into Harry Potter. What house do you think he's in? I'm a Gryffindor dude. I could see. He's that. definitely a Gryffindor just because he's a humble, like sweet guy. There's like no evil Thanks. in him, um, <laughs> unless there has to be. You know what I mean? Like Harry. Yeah. Harry Potter. Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> every time someone says their names, I you guys know that video? Yeah. It's like run, run. Run Weasley. That I, one. Oh, the Harry Potter, Dude, Potter, Potter house. Potter, like all of them, like <laughs> it's funny to me. There's like two things from Harry Potter that stick out to me. When someone says Harry Potter, the only thing that goes through my head, Harry Potter, Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the thing. Mm-hmm. And the second one is the one line where Ron's like, not me, not, not you. you. Or it's no, no, not me, not Hermione. Not Hermione, you. you. That one, like, you. I, that was so funny to me when he was playing chess. He was yeah, like, you. you. I'm like, okay. Anyways, uh, yeah, yeah, he's definitely Gryffindor, and I think I actually took the test. Okay, what are you? And I am half Gryffindor, half Slytherin. Well, you can't be half, you know. No, literally, like I'm dead ass, like in between. I'm like a forty percent uh, Gryffindor, 
and then like a forty percent Slytherin, and then the rest is just. Isn't that kind of what Harry was blood. like? They're gonna put yeah. a Slytherin. Mm-hmm. Oh, so you're saying you're Harry Potter, Mads? Of course, the coolest one. What do you think Jared is? Hufflepuff. <laughs> Hey, don't laugh when you say that, okay? No, I'm proud no to be a hate. Hufflepuff. No, you ain't you are? Yeah. <laughs> no hate against anyone who's I a Hufflepuff. I love Jared, bro. Or like a Ravenclaw. But like, I don't know. I just... Ha- I think, <laughs> I think, <laughs> I think Dude, I'm, I'm a Ravenclaw, but I got Gryffindor. If you were to be yeah. a character from Harry Potter, like not like who you'd want to be, like who resembles you the most? I, dude, you're Snape. Oh, yeah. you're Snape. You're Snape Dude, for sure you keep the same see- expression. Yes, yeah. the same expression. I feel like I'm less hostile. No, you're yeah, you're very chill. But I think yeah, Snape honestly is my favorite character. Yeah, oh yeah, so that's yeah. a compliment. He will be too. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Mm-hmm. I do. I, I don't even know what I'd be like if, given his youth. I feel like I'd be more like a Dumbledore. Dumbledore. You think? <laughs> what do you think I would be? Um, you're gonna say Harry Potter. No. Harry Potter. Harry Potter. I'd say Dumbledore. Yeah, I just feel like just like not as old, obviously. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Jared, you're a uh, the owl. No, 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 no. I'm you're Hedwig? you're shame. You're Seamus. Is that his name? The kid who always blows up the shit. Oh, the yeah, you <laughs> are. You are. Wait, no. That's who's the kid or that you're cuts? Neville. Who, yeah, Neville. Neville. That's the kid that cuts off the snake. Oh, God. Well, somebody. Neville did kind of have a glow up. Yeah, dude. Know? I'm going to say it like. Yeah. He goes, he has a remember and he goes, I don't remember what I've forgotten. And then it's like, <laughs> not, you're not, he's not wearing his cloak. I'm pretty sure that's I what feel it like is. as much as you probably won't even think this about yourself, you're not even just because she's a girl character, Hermione, because she's like very good. Oh. Like mostly everything she does. I feel like I'm not as much of yeah. like I don't have a stick up my ass. You know what I mean? Like, you know? I like well, it depends on the day. Like Sometimes I walk in your room, I'm like, what's going on like in here? You're like, it's really oak. <laughs> she does them very well, and I think you know yeah. your strengths. Okay, wait. So obviously, y'all have seen Harry Potter, right? Obviously, we know Indy is Slytherin. S- no, but who? Malfoy. Malfoy. Okay, <laughs> let's uh, move on. <laughs> I love you, Indy, but like a a stuck up like I love I love. Whoa! Indy. Hot <laughs> take. <laughs> but like very like. Dude, someone cranked the AC. Be, uh, wait till I tell my father about this. I don't know. I'm very dark, very always wears black. I'm not going to get on this boat with you because um, I have to see her often, but you can be on this island by yourself. Stop. Indy knows I love her. I'm a Slytherin when I can be, but I just lean more towards Gryffindor. I gotcha. But yeah, we're the, I, mean, I mean, me and Indy Zach's are like, scared for his life. <laughs> no, but she is. She's definitely Draco Malfoy. Yeah, Neville. Neville. Yeah, you are. You're definitely a mixture of Seamus and Neville. Oh wait, dude. No, I thought I would also be more like the twins. I am a twin. You but are. Bro, bro. That's what I, was oh. I act exactly I like. Them. I could see that. Yeah, where we're just like constantly making jokes or like and sneaking around in the back. George. You know what I mean? Yeah. I want to be Severus Snape. <laughs> dude, yeah. She wants me to be Severus Snape for Halloween. Yeah, and that's I want to be Bellatrix. Halloween. Should do that. Yeah. Oh, that'll be fun. Bellatrix right? is that'd so be sick. cool. She's so pretty. Jared Owl. What? You could hang out with them all night. Be the owl. Be the Sick. owl, yeah. I just go. I have like a beak. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's like, oh, Harry Potter, who's that? Guess what, guys? I can't see out of my eyeballs. But you know who's got me? Warby Parker is committed to providing exceptional vision care online and in stores, offering eyeglasses, sunglasses, eye exams, contact lenses. Glasses start at $95, including prescriptions, Definitely sunglasses, part, progressives, and blue light lenses are also available. I decided to do the whole ad read because I wanted to. Oh. <laughs> you understand that? Okay. okay. I'll let I'll let it go. Do you guys mind if I try on a couple of these glasses? I actually, okay, so I actually did go online and I picked out five glasses. I've worn contacts my entire life. But so, so do I. Sucks. But I've never owned Same. a pair of glasses. You yeah. want to try those this on? This is not my try on, but I like these ones a lot. No, those one looks, no, I got some for you too. I feel pretty smart. Zach, so studious. Well, I'm a little nervous. A little bit of a Harry Potter vibe with these ones on me. No, oh, those definitely. go so well with your outfit. Oh really? wait, I actually really yeah with like oh, really? the you kind look of like denim. you read for fun. That's the goal. And you can't even read, so that's the craziest part. <gasps> okay, how do we feel about these? Yeah, those are my favorite. Whoa, on him. I love that. I feel like a little Peter Parker vibe. I just think it's crazy that these like start at $95 like That's with the prescription lenses crazy. because like growing up it would be like 400 bucks you guys should definitely try Warby Parker's free home try on program you can order five pairs of glasses to try on at home for free um for five days and there's already like prepaid shipping return and you don't even have to buy them if you don't find a pair that you like but I'm sure you will because so really try cute. five pairs of glasses at home for free at warbyparker.com slash dropouts. That's warbyparker.com slash dropouts. What's up, guys? We have a sponsor, and this one is tasty. With HelloFresh, you get fresh, pre measured ingredients and mouth watering seasonal recipes delivered right to your door. Skip trips to the grocery store and count on HelloFresh to make cooking easy and fun and affordable. And 
That's why it's America's number one meal kit. How stressed out do you get going to the grocery store? So stressed, I don't want to carry on with my day. I cry often. I you feel know. that. A lot of times, I'll just go on for days without any groceries because I hate going to the grocery store. But with HelloFresh, they get shipped right to your door. All of the ingredients, everything you need, right to your door. And then you have a ready-to-go meal ready to make in about 30 minutes. Easy, fun, affordable. And on top of that, I eat, you, you already know this. I eat the same thing every day. Yeah. I have a reminder on my phone that says dinner, colon, chicken, rice, and veggies. It's very boring. And you, you want to change it up. I want to change it up. HelloFresh has more than 27 recipes that they send you. Like last night, we had, it was still chicken, but we had this like wonderfully crusted chicken with green beans. Look, guys, I know this is a sponsorship, but the chicken we had last night was actually really good. It was and seriously we're like, some of the best chicken I've it, ever I was had like, wow, life. that is this is a delicious meal. Because I do, I also do eat the same thing every day. I'm like, this is a nice change up. Get HelloFresh. It's really worth it. It's yummy, yummy in your tummy. And what else could you really ask for? You know what I mean? Go to HelloFresh.com slash dropouts12 and use code dropouts12 for 12 free meals, including free shipping. That's HelloFresh.com slash dropouts12 and use the code dropouts12 for 12 free meals including the shipping they take care of that for you all right back to the podcast okay but wait i have that so you've uh, you've seen it right yeah okay yeah. so at the end do you know when harry like dies quote unquote and he like uh, has he not yes, seen, he's seen the whole thing oh you okay, know when okay. he like you dies and I've goes into the okay. white room like the train station with dumbledore and he sees yeah. dumbledore you know he actually uses the um what's the, i just remembered it the, the stone. stone you know he uses it yeah I she never knew that. She didn't get that. The, like, my first time watching it, I was like, obviously, times. like, he used it on himself. He's yeah. in heaven. She didn't realize yeah. that. She was I sitting there. Know. She's like, oh, the he's going to use it on himself. I'm like, called. haven't you seen this? Wait, <laughs> that for was... me, every time you watch it, you'll always figure out more stuff that you never knew. And what like, did you that's think happened in that scene? Though? I don't know. The last time I watched it was like two years ago, and I just wasn't paying attention. Mm. And now like, every time before that, I was just so much younger. But now yeah. that I watched it, I was like, no way. Because I was actually paying attention. <laughs> like, well, I kept telling him to shush. That was the thing is like. <laughs> he was like um, watching it. I know. I was like so quiet watching it. I'd ask like a few questions. Mm -hmm. And she was a big help. Like, I like me personally, not like spoiling the movie for me, but like Helping. answering me, answering my questions as they go. Because like instead of waiting and then me asking, like, you just get out of the way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But she would be like this, and then I'd ask a question, be like, shh, you're going to find out. So, like, some things, it would happen, like, right after I asked. Yeah. Or, like, she would just tell me, and it like, helped me understand the movie a lot more. so good. I could watch it so many times. Well, that was the thing. So, like, the whole thing with, like, Dumbledore being there is that, like... This is just a Harry Potter fan no, podcast. Well, at one point, Dumbledore had all three items, right? And they say whoever had, all, like, the Elder Wand, the Stone, and the Cloak was the master of death, you know? And then in the books, I think it's written that when Harry dies, he's greeted, or uh, death greets him as an old friend. And then Dumbledore is there. And so they're saying that oh. Dumbledore this whole time has been death, mm -hmm. you know? But I also like how, like, ethically, like, he theoretically could have used the stone on Dumbledore. Yeah, but notice how True. he got it passed down. He ended up with all three as well. Yeah, so... Yeah. I he just broke like the last thing. That's so <laughs> stupid. Why did he keep it? Uh, he that's like the most it. humble thing ever to like break the. Okay. Can they were like, These what are you going to do with it? He just goes, <laughs> yeah. And he I breaks it. I was like, oh, what? That was like. Somehow it's going to get put back together. You and think? I'll do I it. think they're going to make another. Because remember, they have the play, The Cursed Child, which yeah. is the next movie. And they just should, they should honestly just do one more. But Nothing that's a, a little duct tape couldn't fix. <laughs> <laughs> Just one more. But that's the thing. Everybody always wants one more, and then they make one more, and then and you it. end up with, like, Fantastic Beasts or whatever. Yeah, but Fantastic Beasts is actually pretty cool because it's before Hogwarts was, a, like, a thing. Like, yeah. it's still a thing, but it shows Dumbledore when he's younger. That is true. So I that think that's cool, and it also shows, like, I don't know, all the people they talk about. <laughs> I think I, don't know, I think it's cool. I like it. No, I have it a lot of stuff, though. <laughs> All right, should we should we get into Mads' favorite game, Red Flags? Oh yes, yeah, Mads has been please. dying to play this game. Please, I love this is game. Is this just as like yeah, when I think it's gonna be? Yeah, if we keep talking, it'll just be a Harry Potter episode. Here we go. <laughs> Best I've ever oh, actually done that. Oh my gosh, you're not gonna choose. I don't even know what mine means. Like the red one, you guys might have to explain. Okay, well then you okay. go first. You read yours first. All right, lives so, in a castle. Okay, so that's good. Okay, just was on the news for rescuing a cat. Okay. Little Interesting. Kid. Right, right, right. Like local hero. Local oh, hero. Yeah, local hero. Body type dumpster. What does that even <laughs> mean? Like, <laughs> so it's just. Come dumpster. Anyways, keep going. Is, I don't know if that was. Yeah, I just. Yeah, I just think they're like really ugly. That's red flags, the adult version. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we have. I got him in like body type dumpster. Like maybe you're just not physically attracted to them. Yeah, they're, they're just like. 
they're a wide they're load. They're a personified dumpster. Like they they yeah. don't look good physically. They okay. Look, they look okay. So yeah, you get well, you get a local hero in a castle, but they're just not attractive. They're just they're okay. Yours sounds good, but you could get. A respectful woman. Okay. Okay. Who's a supermodel. Nice. Fantastic. But to right. tie in to the dumpster over here, <laughs> she is the worst smelling Ooh. person in the entire world. I couldn't do it. Uh uh-uh. uh. I'm a I smell can. person too. If you. Okay. Oh. Oh. Jared. Jared. I can't. My cologne smells fire. Right now. Owns <laughs> owns an island in the Bahamas. Oh my God! Wow. You've been on a cruise. I have been on. A You've cruise. been the Bahamas. No. Nope, All right. Well, just pretend. Um, owns a time machine. That's kind of sick. A, a winner. Sick. Yeah, it's hard. A okay. winner in itself. Unfortunately, thinks you're ugly, oh. which happens. But you can go back in time with them. How how vocal is she about um, my ugliness? She's brutal. <laughs> this person <laughs> thinks you're ugly, and you know it. That's all I'm trying to say. That's wow. So do you want someone that thinks you're ugly, someone that looks like a dumpster or smells really really bad? But even if they think you're ugly, they're still with you because you have a Dude, great personality. I would just go for the. You get a time machine. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Yeah. And an island in the Bahamas. Yeah. Like, I'll be ugly for great vacations. Yeah, do it. Yeah, I'm and, going with I'm going with Zach. Machine. Nice. All right, so yeah. do we just put these to the just side. Put them to the side. Yeah. Now All right, it's Christian. Your turn, Stephanie. All right. Oh, so wait. Now you guys are yeah. picking yeah, a girl now we're for gonna me. Pick oh, a girl sick. For you. This is cool. I like how this game functions. Right. Now. I understand. Like it rotates. Yeah, yeah. I like this. Okay, this is cool. All right, Jerry, you can go. Oh wait, no, you first. You first. Okay. Um, so this girl, she loves you unconditionally. That's all you can ask Amazing. for. Amazing. That's right. Yeah. Also, for the kid that was spitting bars over there, she's also a famous rapper. So, oh. so you guys can Dude, just, you got a winner over there right, right? now. Yeah. <laughs> um she's also, but the bad thing is she <laughs> she's afraid of stoplights. So she just doesn't drive, you know? That's fine. That's fine. It's not even she's bad, dude. You might, dude, that's going to be hard to beat. You <laughs> okay. She's um, the famous rapper. Fun. Okay. Um, owns a hundred horses. <laughs> she's a horse. He, is that know. the bad one? <laughs> 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 that's a so lot of names. I know he doesn't like that because he doesn't. No. I, no. She, she, no I, she asked me one day if I'd want a farm. And I think, yes, I just I don't want to live on the farm. I'd want it to be something that, like, I can go to. And I oh, yeah, like yeah. have, like, people that feed oh, the I animals. I just know me with my ambitions that I wouldn't be able because I, I love animals to death i just know me on a farm Not i like a, the city you know yeah. what i mean i grew up what even is my bad card can i change it that's what like is it? it oh no yeah keep it can i see it you're gonna have to read it because i don't even know if that, that's english i cannot see <laughs> it. I don't know if that's english <laughs> i can't read anyways owns a hundred horses loves to laugh and then the bad one is you can read it i don't want to read it and mess writes up erotic word. lassie fan fiction <laughs> You know, like the dog Lassie. Yeah, she writes no. sex books about <laughs> yeah, the dog. And I yeah, I do. I picked that up. Yeah, yeah. But like, you're into that. Don't she's, choose mine. She's a little Yo, too words into animals. Pop up. I'm she's whatever. a little too he's like, into I'm the horses. Ri- he's like, I'm, I'm really into animals. <laughs> <laughs> she, uh, uh, she has a hundred horses. What could you expect? I mean, listen. A hundred horses and a dog fetish. <laughs> I mean, look at Jared. He has a dog fetish. He's doing great in life. All right. Oh my god. Airline <laughs> pilot has an eight pack. I don't Whoa. know if um, always she's competing with me. Jack than you. Always wear. I have an eight pack. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> always wears a Bluetooth headset. Ew. Just no. always on Dude, call. No. Uh, there's a clear winner no. here. Yeah. Thank you. I'm gonna take the dog. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm gonna take Jerry. He just starts dating yeah. the dog, not even the girl. <laughs> oh Fuck it, give me Lassie. Okay, my turn. All right. So now it's a guy's perspective. Now it's a guy's perspective. Two of these. I want like the random. Let's put <laughs> that one. Let's see. Is yours awful? No, mine mine are just <laughs> weird. Like the bad cards are not even. Mine like was addicted to like dogs or whatever. <laughs> like. Addicted to dogs. <laughs> All right, Jared, you wanna go? Addicted go. to dog dicks. Um dog they're dicks. the funniest person in the world. Okay. Okay. So they're always gonna make you laugh. Love that. You enjoy laughing? Uh-huh. They're also You've done it before. I do. <laughs> never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, never gonna run around <laughs> or desert you. Fantastic. Okay. We always get that card. Rick roll. You guys live for it. Yeah. Um, but the bad thing is um, they fully believe that they're a Jedi. Dude, that way. Wait, wait, wait. So it's someone that's never going to give them up, someone that makes them laugh, and then someone who thinks they're a Jedi. Yeah. Dude, oh. I am a Jedi, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, go. But how weird would that be just f- they fully, like. No, bro. When I was so younger, like- when I was seven, <laughs> I went to Orlando, and I waited an hour and a half to get on that stage just to do the moves that they teach you so I could get a signed certificate that's saying I'm a certified You're- Jedi. <laughs> oh, my God. I wait, think I, I just read you- Christian's yeah, card. I forgot you told Dude, me that. Dude, that's me, bro. Like, literally. Whoa. 
I just found it. If you don't choose that one, then there's some beef going on. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't understand this one. It says, life is the true story that blank oh, is based on. Oh, yeah. I didn't get that. Okay, yeah, cool. Yeah, you can't have a feeling. All right, model. You never get sick while you date them. That's you know, a great really health. Really fantastic health. Never get sick. Refuses to cover their face while sneezing. I mean, that kind of cancels out, though. You're not going to get sick. So yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah fine. I'm never going to get sick. They don't cover their so face. Basically, yeah. No COVID. Yeah. No COVID. No COVID. Wow. In a world pandemic. That's a good, that's that's good. A good card. That's good. Um, I've actually never had COVID. Have you guys ever had COVID? No. No? no uh, I don't. Maybe. Well, Zach, I've never we, had I think maybe way before. Zero. I think a lot of people have had it way before it was even a thing. Yeah, I think I because might like, have because I lost my taste and everything. Really? Okay. This was like over a year ago. Oh, dude, yeah. this was like when yeah. we were still. It was like, like before February. it was popular. Yeah, yeah. it was like February yeah. of 2020, and then Zach was like literally had every symptom. He was like coughing, sweating, <laughs> nauseous, no taste. You I know, was a COVID hyperventilating. Wow. Hyper. Wow. Dude, you're kind of the COVID pioneer. <laughs> it is real. It is what the it COVID is. The COVID trendsetter. Oh. <laughs> Okay, um, you have an Instagram account, uh -huh. and you need pictures for that. Well, this person, photographer. Oh, so. fun, fun, fun. Um, also, the best sex ever. Whoa. Oh. Ever. <laughs> That's ever been had. That's ever, um, been, had. ever been, unfortunately been had. Unfortunately, begins every sentence with actually. No, I wouldn't oh. do it. <laughs> okay, well, you could Actually, could've. like, actually. He's in the middle of sex. Actually, this is great. <laughs> <laughs> actually, it is. Actually, a yeah. Uh. Actually. Yeah. You'd get, like, no. your brain would hurt. I would oh, eventually yeah. be like, actually, actually, actually. <laughs> I would like just start, oh, that would irritate me. I think I'm going to go with this one. The model. The model, and then you'll never get All right, get so I guess day. mine just doesn't matter. Yeah. Literally, bro. Cover. You really just did not You just disrespected Christian. mine. That's I crazy. I don't want to be with someone who thinks they're, they're a Jedi. Jedi. That, that would be. from Star Wars. That's fine. And that's that's fine, uh, dude. I don't like you Star You heard Wars. it here first. They're breaking up. <laughs> or, uh, <laughs> yeah. It's over. All right, Zach. <laughs> this is for you. Hi. Hi. Uh, well, oh, yeah. this person is uh, in touch with their feelings. Gotcha. Okay. okay. <laughs> Something that um, they could probably help you Can with. You um, I pick they're them. also extremely generous, you know? Nice. So they'll, they'll just be super generous to you. <laughs> oh, thanks, Jared. Thanks for <laughs> I was trying to think of something. Um, who thinks of this? They are physically incapable of asking a question. <laughs> How is that even possible? I need That's what I'm, like, like, incapable of asking. A question. I can't even. My brain can't even quantify. So they would never be able to ask a like, yeah, like, ask a question. They would never be able to ask. Well, I guess they could. So still we're just learn declarative all day long. Yeah, you like so instead of being day. like. Instead of being like, oh, what was your favorite sport growing up or whatever, they'd be like, tell me your favorite sport. So, like, Ooh, I, whoa, I kind of like the way you said that to me. You say it slower? Yep. Um, anybody else? <laughs> oh, Christian. Um, beautiful eyes. Nice. You can't take your eyes off them, right? Okay, Literally. so taken right Great out of Mad's contact. dad. The hot barista. Nice. So now, you know, she's just giving you drinks, dude. Like, I love drinks. I and then like coffee, but it's okay. Like, you know, exactly. Maybe water. Maybe yeah. water. Right. Ice down on but, the But, yep regularly this is where the barista comes in okay. okay regularly hosts tea parties for dolls oh so she's psychotic she's crazy yeah she's okay creepy annabelle what are you what are your thoughts then? fantastic drink but expect one to get go to the dolls too i just i've never yeah. been to a tea party seems fun maybe I don't know. <laughs> okay i'm open to it well how about it's you a doll king you have this <laughs> yeah. you have the same favorite movies okay and Love she that. owns a successful startup. Oh, this is beautiful. Wow. But Entrepreneur. she texts mm -hmm. only like exclusively in emojis. <sighs> <laughs> FaceTime. Yeah, I know. But it's just like I just, the whole time I'd be like, can you just chill? And she's like, <laughs> and I'm like, all right. Um, okay. So we got Tea Party Girl. We got emojis. What do you got? Uh, um, we, we got the in-touch, generous girl that is physically incapable of asking a question. That's going to be a lot. Yo, not to get, like, deep or anything, but I just want to, like, can I say something that's, like... Please. All right. So, every time that we've had a round, uh -huh. when we go around and we make our choice, we label them by their one bad trait, but we forget that there's two good traits. Oh. I feel like everybody does that in the world. You focus on, like, I always tell her, like, there's 100 hey. days. Think about it. Yeah. As corny as it sounds. 100 days, someone tells you they love you every single day. One day they tell you they hate you. At the end of the 100 days, you're not going to focus on the 99 good things they did. You're going to focus on the one bad thing they did. That's We're always focusing true. on the one bad thing. There's two good things. Yep. What are your good things, Jared? 
That's yeah, fair. pick off by the good things. They're the in thing. touch with their feelings. Yeah, move on. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, not to get like corny Beautiful for a sec, but I, I just noticed that. Yeah. It's yeah. true. It's no, I no. I, it. I like Christians a lot right now. Um, I'd go Beautiful with the dolls, eyes, hot bro. Barista, and then, and then mine is uh, same favorite movies, and she has her own startup. Come on, bro. She literally saved What's you your a bad seat one at the again? tea party. Oh, uh, oh, she texts exclusively in emojis. I'll probably go with emojis. I don't want people walking in the house yeah. and being like, "Hey, is it, are those a considerable amount of dolls?" And I'm like, <laughs> "Yeah." Uh, my what wife do we do with like the partner. drop? You guys have like dolls right on that couch. Exactly. I, That's what I want. I don't want people to feel creepy when they yeah. walk in the home. Yeah. We can we do another round? I oh yeah. Right, cool. Yeah, we can do another round. All right, Jared, back to you. All right. Let's build my. Perfect How are we girl. not sponsored by Red Flags? I know. That's what, what I'm saying. We gotta hit them up. I should you. probably also just yeah hit them up. <laughs> okay. Uh, who wants to go first? I will. Okay. Rocket scientist. Ah, oh, Basically Elon Musk, Jeff Bezos, if you would. With a wig. Yep. With a Speaks wig. every romance language. Dude, I'm thinking oh French, Italian. That's beautiful. Certain Spanish. dialects of Spanish. Exactly. Wow. Unreal. And then conveniently forgets wallet every date night. Always has ID, though. But, dude, I, I feel like you're a respectful but guy. You're yeah, already paying. I already, you're that's already the thing. Paying. It's exactly. like I already pay, yep. you know. But... Okay, the, it's the conveniently in there that like throws it off, but it's like I'm paying anyway, yeah. you know. So it's fine. Yeah. Okay. She's but got you, a lot of rocket stuff on her mind. I know you like your books, especially the one by your bed. Yep. <laughs> Same favorite books. Okay. Great. Okay, and she's the best-selling author. She loves Diary of a Wimpy Beth, Kid. Yes. So. <laughs> best-selling author. Okay, but so she's, she's just probably not written. sexually attracted to you at all. <laughs> what? But that happens in every oh. relationship of yours, Jared. So don't get too down about it. That's true. Tell Hannah right now in the camera you want to have sex with her. I'm not going to do that. Come on. Her mom watches. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, can get you both into literally anywhere. Oh. That's sick. a sick card. That's awesome. I want that one. Okay. Well, you can't have it. This is George. Um, has a magic bag that contains unlimited cheese. Uh, I do love cheese. There we go. I love I me do. good. <laughs> I <laughs> okay. Wait. Off topic. What's your favorite cheese? Um, that's a good question. Cheddar. Favorite cheese? Pepper Jack. You Facts, it's gas. Yeah. What? what? I, was, I like cheddar, dude. Is but I'm, I, no, I'm going to change it to pepper jack. I like Pep feta too, though. Ooh, My favorite cheese is, is goat cheese. Oh, what is your <laughs> issue? <laughs> um, I'm going to go a little bougie, Fontina. Oops, oh. oops drop, name drop. <laughs> um, okay, unfortunately, it has a dozen kids from a dozen partners, but it happens. My dad's on track for Deck that. Deck tablets. So. <laughs> Yeah, um, I know I'm gonna pass on that one. But why? Already, give me three reasons. I can give you twelve. <laughs> no, Jared, Cheaper by the Dozen was a great movie. Over to anyone. <laughs> Over to anyone. What were you? What were your guys's again? Same favorite book. She's the best-selling author, but she's not sexually attracted to you at all. All right, well, mine was the one that just doesn't. She's a rocket scientist. You know. Oh super yeah, smart. I'm going with yeah, this. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. So you're already paying. I'm already paying, cool. so okay, it's fine. It. All right, so you guys picking my girl now? Oh yeah. Cool. Okay. My girl. Here we go. My girl. Okay, ready. Who wants to go first? You or me, Jared? Um, I'll go first. Okay. Genius level IQ. This girl knows words and a lot of them. Mm -hmm. um, same favorite foods. You ever had a food and been like, it'd be nice to enjoy this with a lady? You could do that with my girl. <laughs> Always wears... Okay. Your girl? Always <laughs> Always is a, is a loose term. In, the, in this sense, <laughs> well, I, it probably means... Well, if the card says always, then it probably means every single time. Forever. We'll assume. Always wears a luchador mask. <laughs> what is that even? What is that? Like um, the, you know the Mexican the wrestlers? The, and they have like the mask. Oh, on? like Rey Mysterio. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, he was my favorite wrestler growing up. Well, this. So. Uh, it, well, do we have the girl for you? <laughs> well, someone's yeah. pants yeah. just got tighter because <laughs> no. this person. <laughs> no, dude. I, don't know I already know be. he's not going to choose I, mine. I want to see your face. Yeah, exactly. Right, go. What's All right. I can already say. Yeah. No, you go. Oh, I go? Oh, yeah, I know why. I just know he's not going to choose mine. Yeah, I can see the red card. Yeah, he's not going to choose mine. Even though he's like, D we always focus on the bad things. Do you're not gonna choose it because of the bad things? Right, so. okay. Of course. Well, there are factors. I I'm I'm gonna tell you now. You're gonna choose this one because okay. the the red uh, the red card. Uh, first of all, she owns one of every car. So you, I'm sure you've been have in your oh, you can pick drive of the letter. Everyone. Yeah. I'm a bicycle guy. No, I'm, <laughs> a, <laughs> I'm more of a pedal myself. Yeah. Um, and she's extremely courteous. You know, so she's very polite, polite, you know, mm -hmm. and then I don't even know why this He's is a red blushing. card. Don't make him blush. Uh, this girl is literally Nickelback. 
So the band. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> no. This um, is how you. Yeah. So she, yeah, she, she is, is Nickelback. She is, Nick, she is Chad Kroger, actually. <laughs> well, and the rest no of the band. No way. And the rest of the band. Right, so she'd yours? be like really polite, but then she would just like talk like That's that. That's how and, like, she owns one of every car is yeah. because she's, Nickelback. she's All right, you superstar go. Nickelback. <laughs> the band. Okay, she's very driven. Okay. Okay, and she owns an adorable coffee shop. That's cute. That's a cute girl that owns shit, a coffee yeah. shop. But she hits on every server. Can't do it. Oh, <laughs> oh my no. god! Welcome back, yeah. Nickelback. Not even like me. <laughs> not even like me. How guys? I'm sure you know. You've probably been with a girl that's a little too flirtatious. Oh yeah. yeah. Doesn't make you feel good. Yeah. No. No. Nope. It's like because bro, if you were doing it to them, you, they, you know damn well they would stare you back. A hundred. I can't do that. No. I'm gonna choose Chad. Oh yeah. hell yeah. I just thought the cue up Nickelback. At least my mom put me on them Nickelback. You really? know, back in the day, dude. Really? Actually, as much as like they got memed, they had some pretty good songs. Dude, so. that's the thing. I I don't think I've ever really memed Nickelback. I love. I thought they were good. Yeah, I, I love, love Nickelback. Them. I just. Why do I feel like Avril Lavigne dated lead singer? That was some forty one. Uh, really? A- AKA your dad when he was younger. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Wait, I thought it was something. Wait, Nickelback. are we picking Mads? Uh, yeah. yeah. Someone? Okay, Jared, you want to go first? You want me to go first? No. Yeah. No, sure, Christian, you go okay, first. Christian, yeah, I okay. Have, I have possibly the worst <laughs> dateable candidate ever. All right. One has the hottest friends. You're dating them. I don't know why you're worried about their <sighs> friends. Oh, okay. Has the hottest friends. Okay. The president. That, that's a oh, tough. Oh, just straight up the president. Tough job. So Joe Biden with some baddies. <laughs> yeah, Joe yeah. Biden Joe with Biden. a squad of 10s. And then Tinders during sex. <laughs> so you're... You're oh having an intimate that's time. That's all pretty bad guys. Ha- yeah, exactly. You're having an intimate time. They're just like, next. You know what I mean? Like, that's that's pretty I don't think we up. have to go, Jared. I think we know what yeah. she wants. Yeah. No. Okay. Um, oh, still, like, I had three red cards right there. Okay. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah. Perfect communicator. Huge in a I'll relationship. I'll take her. <laughs> <laughs> Sign me up. Honest. Okay. Okay. Only eats deep fried food. So. That's not. Well, a little that, gross. Like They're going to be a little greasy, and that's, yeah. you know, it happens. It's not that, though. <laughs> that's not. You can work around that. Yeah, yeah, as long as there's a KFC nearby, you're good to go. Yeah. <laughs> Except now, when I want to cook a meal, and they're like, make sure it's deep fried. <laughs> 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 you know what I mean? No, but think about it. Everything's deep fried. No, thanks. Go. Oh, you're, my God. Come on, Jared. It's all you. All right. So this person is the world's best hairstylist. Okay. That's fire. <laughs> that's right. Do they'll, my hair. They'll do your hair I feel like the best hairstylists are always bald. <laughs> exactly. Okay, so this person's probably bald. Um, <laughs> okay. And to help with that, uh, or like that helps them because they're also an Olympic gymnast. Ever heard of it? So uh-huh. great shape. How are they the best hairstylists and have time to be an Olympian? Okay, well, <laughs> yeah. that's what makes okay. this person. So they're they're not going to have any events, time for so. you is all I'm saying. Yeah. Now, Mads, how how much do you like food? I love food. Okay. This person also likes food. Uh, they talk dirty to all of their food, though. <laughs> My face. Did you see that? Yeah. Like <laughs> you literally <laughs> went. Oh. Uh, <laughs> President not looking like, too bad. They're like, mm, <laughs> you sexy so, chicken Oh, tender. two piece yeah. in one uh, pod. <laughs> <laughs> mm. uh, what was yours? Um, eats a lot of fried food. <laughs> it's not even that bad. Honest, perfect communicator. I, I thought you said only go. eats fried food. Yeah. Deep fried, yeah. Yeah, only eats deep fried food. Only. But I'll hear me out. What if they talk dirty to all of that deep <laughs> fried food? Uh, no. Definitely. I win? Always eat, yeah. All right. Extra well, dirty I mean, you couldn't, you couldn't go with Joe Biden with the baddies. Extra no. dirty to the chicken breasts. <laughs> all right, last one. This is me. I'm trying to find love right now. So if one of you guys could pull out all the stops. Thank you. you know, Zach, I, I, yeah, please. I have a good feeling. Thank you so much. I think you're going to like her. Dude, these red cards are so weird. <laughs> we should do live speed dating on here. <laughs> Dude, I feel like my red card's not even gonna... Actually, no. This is gonna affect you a little bit. All right. Can I go first? Just cause, like, Yeah, go know, first. Loves their job. Good. Passionate. Nothing better than a girl who their face lights up when they talk about something they're passionate about. Oh, my God. Exactly. You're literally not gonna want to date my girl. Can fire your most hated coworker or boss. Jared's gonna lose his job. <laughs> okay. Sorry, Jared. But Zach, what? You're a funny guy. Allegedly, only laughs at their own jokes. Oof, you would hate that. Yeah, or maybe yeah, maybe you make you comments, <laughs> and I I can tell even though you just you're feeding off our laughter. But maybe I it'll push me to be the best I can be, 
Or All maybe right. it would just destroy you inside because the person I'm already you love destroyed. Okay. Never Hiroshima. Right <laughs> in the heart. Over to you. Yours <laughs> says never arrives prematurely. Just well, like professional. I wish, like, <laughs> I, wish <laughs> I could have that card. Professional wrestler. Oh. <laughs> have you seen some of the female professional wrestlers? I just don't want her she to be able to. No, are we talking about like UFC wrestle or more oh, like this, WWE? Okay, I was this thinking is WWE. The bad, this is the bad this is the bad one. Tells you to calm down. <laughs> <laughs> Tells you to Can calm coast. down after everything you say. <laughs> so calm down. <laughs> no, I was just thinking that maybe, maybe Zach. I said calm down. <laughs> You're right. I apologize. Um, okay. Just with your attitude today. I know. Jesus, God. this guy. Always. All right. Now this girl. At least she'll laugh. <laughs> <laughs> your parents love them. Okay. So that that's a plus. How did my dad meet her? <laughs> has a has a mansion in Wisconsin. Wisconsin. Um, nice. So it's just T Pain. Yeah, it's just T Pain. Your parents love T Pain. Um, but the the red card <laughs> is she's T Pain. Is she <laughs> she has never spelled a word correctly. <laughs> Okay, and that's Reminds okay. Me of myself. I was literally, I, I wanted to say it, but I didn't want to be rude, bro. But never. I heard her, like, we were in the car earlier. She was sending this brick. I wasn't even looking over. I could just watch her type. And I just see her literally speak Texas speech because she couldn't spell it, bro. No, I actually just, I didn't know how to spell it. I didn't even try. Wait, wait, wait. wait. This, this might be fun. Let's do a mad spelling bee. Okay. Okay, after this. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm going to go with Jared's. Really? Yeah. Really? Your parents yeah. love them and she has, has a, a mansion, mansion in Wisconsin. So yeah, but just like a little dyslexic. Okay. Yeah, just everything is just misspelled. It's not that bad, it's bro. Not bad. I mean, never laugh and then calm down. Oh, yeah, yeah, those are terrible. Those, those are, are terrible. Awful. Yeah, calm down. But commonly calm misspelled down. words. Give her one word. I just want maybe you got to prove yourself here. I can prove myself. We should give her something like pterodactyl. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, doesn't pterodactyl start with like a P or something? There we go. Does it? One letter away. You're not going to get pterodactyl. Bro. That's a hard word to spell. No, just, just, get, like just give her a normal word. Yeah, I'll give you a right. normal word. Um, Your word, Madison Lewis, Whoa, is getting... conscientious. Consci- <laughs> conscientious. Conscientious. Is, Dude, conscious. I don't think I can spell that. Conscientious? Yeah. Con- I thought you were going to say conscience. Okay. S. Yeah. <laughs> She's not going to get the next letter. <laughs> Close. It makes a she sound. <laughs> there we Conchi- go. We'll just give a letter. Uh, I. Am I right? No, nope. it's a C. Hmm. I comes next, though. I'll give you that. C I O U S. Nope. How about Wednesday? About okay, you Matt, you Wednesday. Spell Wednesday. A lot of people cannot spell. It's Wednesday. I spell February. February. Yeah, a lot of people forget that R. <laughs> You're just <laughs> sounding it out. Spell it. February. Got it. Yeah, no, because a lot of <laughs> people miss that R in there. Yeah. Something R Y. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you can help us get to um, 100,000 subscribers for our one year, for one year, my birthday. Jared, How far are you guys? Birthday? We're uh, like 15,000 away. Yeah. You guys got that. Oh, we got that. Uh, yeah. No, Maybe. we got that. We'll nah, see. You got that. Um, you got that. <laughs> thank you to our gracious host and huh? your guest that you. Woo. Wow. Um, you can tell. And then if you want to say anything to Indy directly into camera. Um, Have fun in Chicago. Your job oh, trust killing. me. She's going insane in Chicago. Is she? <laughs> yeah, she's losing her mind. Why? Well, they. Free vacation. She's been, she's been filming, but like the first day. So all of the castmates are on set and she's out of the city like 30 minutes. And she only filmed one day so far. And the rest of the day she's had off. So she's just been there by herself. She's like. Just like in the hotel room. <laughs> Yeah, but she films That's the rest the of the day, so it'll be fun. Yeah, well, we love you, Indy. I'm a better host than you are. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to follow us on everything. Uh, his new at is Severin. S-E-B-R-I-N. And then um, we got Dakota Lewis. And then, hey, it's Jerry Bear Music 12. I don't know what your username is. Follow me at Indiana Masara. And bye, guys. Make sure to DM me on Instagram if you stay till the end. Something sweet. Maybe like a brownie. Like maybe a brownie recipe. Like Your favorite dessert recipe. Just brownie. Okay. Oh.